everyone welcome back to maths with hira in today's video we are going to find out how to multiply using box method this method is mostly used in uh, the us so a lot of my students uh, they have been uh, moving from UK to the US and they're not familiar with the box method so I was uh, explaining this to them so I thought why not I make a video for you some of you as well who are struggling with this so let's continue and uh, see how we can multiply two numbers using box method okay it's pretty easy let's say we have a number um 11 let's make it a little bigger and uh, we are multiplying it with 22. so how we are going to multiply this let's So as you can see that it is a box method, so we need to make a box first. This is a box. And then we are going to divide the box into four. This. To draw a line. And that would be... Now, as you can see, it says 11. This means, how would you write it down 11 in when you would break it down in terms of tens and units? If you see, this is actually two numbers, so tens and units. If you have to write down 11, how would you write it? One ten, zero units. One unit, zero tens, right? So exactly the same way we can break down 11 as 10 here, one here. And then if you look at 20, 20 can be broken down, broken down as 22, can be broken down as 20 and then 2. So it would become 20 and 2. Simple as that. Now, the next step is you need to count down. You need to multiply these two numbers like this. You can ignore the zeros just count on how many zeros do you see across them two zeros just put two zeros here and then you multiply just the leftover number without the zero with the other leftover number on the other side so two times one is two so you got 200. the next step you got to multiply this 20 with one or you would just multiply this two with one which is just two and since there is just one zero, you would just put down 20 there. Right? Now, we are done with this 20. Now, we are moving on with this 2 and this 10. So, again, ignore the zero. Just put down the number of zeros. Do you see? You only see one zero. You put it down there. And then you just times the 2 with 1, which is 20. And next, you don't see any zeros between 2 and 1. So you would not write down any zero there and you would just put two and this is what you got. So now your numbers, your numbers are inside the boxes. You see four boxes. Next step, you got to just write down these numbers in the order, like the highest number first, second number, the third, and then two. Now you got to add all of them up. When you add all of them in the tens, it would be two. This is four. And this is two. So this is what we got. 242 is the answer to this question. So you see, it's easy. 
not too difficult. Only thing you are looking at just a simple table. It's not like the bigger tables, tens and twelves. You're just multiplying with a simple table. So that's all about the box method, multiplication method. I hope you understood it. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.